bill of material that we initiated yesterday. <clears throat> so, so with the bill of material, as I, I was saying yesterday, that um, where we need the bill of material is um, where you're selling something like computer or where there's some accessories you also providing to the customer. Okay, so so there you want to explore the bill of material. Okay, so it could be computer, it could be a pump, or it could be anything. Okay, where it has some sub components. Okay, and uh, you want to show all the sub components along with the main item. So that's where we use um, <clears throat> this bill of material. So let me show you today um, bill of material. So let me find a material here. For example, for this material, uh, I will show you how we can create and customize uh, a bill of material. Okay, so so what I can do, I will I need. So just suppose this is a, this is a computer, so I will call it say computer. Okay, and uh, computer model number one two three four or something, and I will save it. Okay, and I will create some sub components. Okay, like uh, these. Uh, mouse and CPU keyboard and all that okay so let me create some more materials quickly and then I will show you so if I go back um, so mm01 to create new materials so what I will do I will create a couple more materials and uh, you can when you're creating a material you can copy as well from it from other material okay so for example this one I will copy from this material and I will the new material I'll call it p 1091a or something okay and uh, enter enter and here I can copy from the same plant same sales hog And you can see it will copy everything. So all I need to do is to change the description here. Okay, so I will call it. Um, if you look at this diagram, uh, mouse. Okay, one is done. I'll create another one in the same way. I'll call it B. You can call it anything you want. I will call it printer. And uh, another one, C. And also, sorry, I forgot to tell you regarding that uh, that uh, item category thing yesterday. Uh, I didn't get a chance uh, uh, to have a look into that one. So I will discuss that first thing in the next class next week. And uh, thanks, Kiran, for sending that document to me. And I will have a look today. <clears throat> so third material will be. Uh, say keyboard okay so let's keep only three materials okay so I've created uh, P1091 A B and C okay these are the like sub components of the main computer okay so first we need to create a bomb bill of material okay so so what I need to do is to either you can go to CS01 directly okay or you can go to uh, logistics this is the menu path sales and distribution master data <coughs> and uh, and others nope products this is that's one bill of material and again bill of material material bomb CA01 okay so if I click on this one I can create a new bomb okay so click on this one here you need to give the top level uh, code okay which is computer so computer is uh, P0 
191 and your plant where you want to create it so 1000 plant we're using and bomb usage so this is very important bomb usage should be five okay so five is sales and distribution okay so just remember to use five as a bomb usage okay and press enter and now we're saying is that when we're selling this computer what should be the sub components okay so sub components should be um, I'll copy this and I'll say a quantity one okay it's not maintained in 1000 why is that let me check Okay, I need to extend the plant data. Give me a second. Um, What I forgot was I need to actually when we're creating a new material you need to go through all the tabs. Uh, probably we don't need this one. So what I didn't do was so I just changed the description here and saved it but you need to go through all the tabs to extend it. Like that. Now save should be fine. Let's do the same thing for B. And C. Okay, that should be fine. So I need to start from the beginning. Again, go to this transaction C A zero one, and same thing. Press. Oh, sorry, that's wrong. It should be P one zero nine one only. Press enter. Now here, give the component one to one. Then uh, B also one then C also one okay so to sell this computer we want to explore this bomb in the sales order okay because we're giving these products as well so I will save it <clears throat> also just to let you know that this quantity one 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 means if I click on this cap this header but default the it's one here what that means is to sell one of this computer we are giving one of one mouse one printer one keyboard okay but there could be some other uh, circumstances where you need to say it's not computer but something else like uh, compressor or something where you can say that we're going to give two okay that for every one piece of this we're going to give two of this one of this and one of this you can do this this as well okay so system will so let's leave it two. for example we're giving say uh, make it one and make mouse two. We're giving giving two mouse just for any reason. Okay, and I will save it. Okay, so now let's do the testing. Now another thing you need to make sure uh, that what is the item category here? Okay, um, actually I have done some changes to the original item category so let me fix that one first and then I will show you this one 